So, you staying out of trouble, man? You better believe it, bro. Totally guilt-free. It's business, business, business with me. Yeah, why does that make me think you're about to ask me to do some dumb shit? Damn, what do you take me for? I'm a giver, not a taker. I don't need anything from you. I want to make a gift of my car to you. It's a special machine, but no, what you have done for me recently is more special. Thanks a lot, bro. You didn't need to do that, though. No, I did. Yeah, there's a little bit of fun for you in the glove compartment. I think you will enjoy it. All right, man. I'll check that out. Yeah, and thank you again.
Okay, if we walk in confident, we have a good time. <laughs> okay. Hey, you on the list? Yes. No. Yes. No. Then you're not coming in. Oh, wait a minute, man. We're relatively important people. We're going in, bro. I don't give a fuck who you think you are. You're not coming in. Come on, man. I'm a VIP. We, we come here all the time. Hey, Des. Hey, man. Tony. I ain't seen him. Hey, man! Luis! Bro, can you get us in? Hey, Brucey. Yeah, sure. Uh, Tessie, take care of them. Oh, thanks, oh. man! Okay, keep it cool, keep it cool. No, no. Man, I'm no, going no, to no, see no. some Boy, vagina tonight! You walked in with one, bro. What? Never mind, man. Hey! So I'm going to go get the drinks! Okay! Good seeing you guys, man. I gotta take care of something. Hey, wait, listen, can I just say something, man? Listen, can I just say the way you dealt with Bori, man? I was really great. Thank you. Hey, uh, don't mention it, man. Unless you want me to kill him. Maybe. Hey, listen, you know, you're just like me. That's right, you're like a, a lone wolf. An adventure. Tough butt. With a sense of this. Not really, bro. I like killing for money. Yes, yes, I know, but that's just your thing, man. Ugh. You know, What's your problem, what? man? Nothing. I didn't mean nothing by it. I'm not gay. It's cool, man. Just don't do it again, man. Hey, look, I fucked three girls last night, man. One of them can't even walk. I mean, now. If she could walk before, she didn't need a wheelchair or anything. Look, I was just checking to make sure you weren't gay, bro. No, not a problem, man. I, I gotta go. Hey, listen. Hey, Luis. Come on, man. We gotta go. Let's go. Alright, man. Peace out, bro. Thank God you showed up, bro. What? I never thought seeing you would make things feel more heterosexual. I'm gonna pretend I didn't hear that, sweetheart. Yeah, it's probably best. Take us over to the fish market. What's happening, Dick? We're getting Gracie back. She's coming home. Are we taking her back? Or well, this gonna be tranquilo? God, I hope so. They're getting the diamonds for her, so they better behave. Shit. Wait a second. Slow up, man. What have the diamonds gotta do with Gracie? What the fuck have we got to do with Gracie? Shouldn't her old man be handling this? Apparently, the kidnappers have asked for these rocks, and we aren't being given much of a choice about it, if you catch my meaning. Oh, great. Angry mobsters. Kidnappers, maniacs. Sounds like another fun day. Nice stuff, take a look.
The exchange is on Charge Island. They're calm by land. We're on the water. Diamonds. What about them? Yo, man. Maybe we got him claiming ownership. He's got some serious resources. Maybe we should think about handing them over to him. We got two options, Lou. Either we give them to the Russian and Ancelotti kills us, or we give them over to the kidnappers. Gracie lives, or we take our chances with the Russian. All right, man. Sounds like you got everything figured out. I got nothing to figure out. Half the city wants to kill me, but they'll be lucky if they can get a chance before I die of a heart attack. Easy, though. The Brown's burning love breakdown. Witnesses say it's like something out of a Vinewood movie. Jimmy and Cole at the scene. That's right, Jim. It's like a Vinewood movie, only without the hokey computer generated effects, terrible dialogue, and shitty acting. In an audacious raid, terrorists have stolen a little Time to bankrupt ourselves. Last chance, D. So you want to hand this stuff over? Sure, I'm sure. Father's gonna kill us if we don't. Yeah, it makes it nice and simple. <laughs> yeah, lends a lot of clarity to my thinking. <laughs> Gracie, you all right? Yeah. Bastard didn't hurt you, did they? She can't speak. We got a gag in her mouth. Give her back, you animals. She suffered enough. Hand over the stuff. Hand over Gracie. I'm here for you, sweetie. Hand over the fucking stuff. All right, calm down. Both of you. Oye. Oh, yeah. We put the ice in the middle. We walk back. Then, you send over the girl. We leave, and you pick up the stuff. Entiende? Sure. Show us the goods. Come back to me, honey. Let her go. Chomp off our boat! Hey, I'm trying, okay? Tony, you're fucking pathetic! Get the motherfucker off our boat! He can't hear you, babe. Don't in a world of his own. Motherfucker! Why do we head out to the caraways? It's fabulous this time of year! The fucking snowway's gone. We can go back now and get those cops sucking kidnappers now, you pussy! Stupid fucking bouncer piece of shit! Go back and get the guys who kidnapped me! The greatest dancer. Gracie, you're gonna have to set the fuck up right now. We don't need to be doing this for you. You and Tony are fucking pussy. I'm gonna make sure my dad fucking has your... Hey there, muscles. No need to hit a lady. She don't got a mouth like a lady, though. And the way she was acting, she was gonna get us killed. I should have given her some pills, but oops! Ah, I took them all! <laughs> Sleep it off, man. You got 
have Gracie back safe and sound, Tom. I hope she was worth two mil. You hit her, right? She had a boating accident. Make sure her old man understands that. I don't want to see her again. Okay, sailor. So long. Looking for trouble, I hope. Oh yeah, bro. I'm in a real rush, and I was thinking I could use a buffalo. You think you could get your hands on one? Sure thing, El. It's gonna be good to get away from Armando. He gets kind of clingy. Are falling apart? No! Yes! No! Uh, sort of! The city's closed down the clubs! You serious? It's motherfuckers! All this fucking bullshit and we forgot to pay off the Citadel! Shit, D! Maybe this is a good thing! At least we can concentrate on getting off every gangster's hit list! We better do it quick! There's no more money coming in! It's only gonna get worse for us! Fuck me, I need some blow!
possibly have to say that I'd want to hear, Rock? Time to face the facts, Jack. Frankly, you're fucked. There's a rich Russian having a powwow with the old man about you and the fag. FYI, they ain't talking about handing you a special commendation. Well, what the fuck are me and Cole supposed to do about that? Let's leave the homo out of this for a minute. Meet me and Uncle Vincenzo in the public toilets in Middle Park. We gotta talk in person. That's what I told him. That shit would never have happened back in the day. <laughs> What's up, ladies? Still living the high life, I see. Fuck you. What you doing here, cruising? <laughs> Very funny. <laughs> you know, Mr. Ancelotti's still blaming all that diamond shit for Gracie's kidnap? Well, you did bring the heat down on the club, so... I can understand why they'd blame you. Yeah, and those chinks, they're still fucking pissed at that dispute of ours. Again, fair enough. Whatever, it don't matter, right? What matters is the Russian has come to Mr. Ancelotti and said he wants the head of anyone involved with the diamonds. Now, on top of all that Gracie and Chink shit, the old man is pissed. He <laughs> wants blood. I think we can cut a deal. We give him one body, all right? So basically, it's you or Tony. One of you has to die. Me and Vince would prefer to work with you and the clubs over the faggot, so you're lucky. You kill Tony. You get to keep the clubs. You and us together, partners. Either that, or the Russian is gonna send some serious people round to whack you and the fag with Ancelotti's sanction. Yeah, you'll both get whacked. You're way out of your league, kid. And you, you're a fucking loser hanging out with children living a fantasy life. I ain't killing Tony, but I may be about to kill you two fucks, though. Then you're a dead man. You and your family and those spick drug dealers you hang out with, you're all dead. It's your choice. It ain't our fault. Fuck you. Think about it. I'll be in touch, you fucking spick. Yo, man, fuck. I don't want to abuse your generosity, but I need a bullet. Like, now. That cool? I'm coming right at you with that shit, L. Anything to help out a friend. Thanks, Ace. You're a good guy. 
maldita madre. 1987. Now somebody's got it. You know. The mix is with us now. You gotta be fucking kidding me. Times change, Tony. Your brand of charming homosexuality, it's kind of run out of steam. Someone has to pay for what's gone down. Do it. Sorry. I'm sorry, man. After all we've been through, Lou! I'm sorry, T. You... You was family, man. But it's either you or all of us. The Russians are coming, man! We don't got time for this gay shit! Fucking pop him already! You fucking moron! Hey, I had second thoughts, man. You fucking killed yourself just then! The Russians... Fucking everyone, they're coming after you. The old man, you're fucking dead. The both of you, they're coming any second and they're expecting corpses. We better not disappoint then. Ah, right, keep your head, Lou. He's a made guy. Fuck him. All right, get out of here, Rocco. This is for the old man and that's it. You're a dead man, Taco. Get out of my club, you fucking mook. You sure that was smart? You sure not shoot me was smart? I don't think so. All right. If we can operate, we're gonna need some, some goodwill here. What now? I don't know. Didn't he say the Russians are coming? Doesn't <laughs> stop, does it? Yo, hey, you got that van of yours? I need to buy some shit. If you need it, you need it. I don't want my boy getting hurt. Oh, yeah, thanks. Perfect for a 
guys want to take us okay. back to home medicine? Where to? Please, you will kill people with your nonsense. Yeah, the I'm gonna... Okay, okay. yes, yeah, probably. Yeah. Thanks. And sleeping with my dad. I tell you, it's a rush driving around with this shit. You just daring people to fuck with you. Check it out. Don't get too cocky, bro. You got priors. If you're going down, you may as well have this with you. I appreciate this. Bye, motherfucker.
my beautiful fucking club! Outside. Then we're gonna have to go meet him, boss. It's gotta end sometime. Outside. Then we're gonna have to go meet him, boss. It's gotta end sometime. Stupid T. T, please don't be stupid. I'll just come find you. Shit.
Double Jumper 4. Ethnics are at it again. If someone's in trouble or on fire, the Weasel News Jumper is there on top of the action. Are you riding the train with a terrorist? What do celebrity vaginas look like? Weasel News is on the scene. We call it News. Your team for... Nice of you to join us, bro. We could do with a driver. Imagine we a pair of fags from a boy band. What info you got on this shit, eh? Word is, people are moving some product across town. We're gonna hijack them on the road, take what we need, and get on with our lives. We some meaty motherfuckers, yo. How's your mom? She's okay. I think she prefers you and A to me, though. I ain't been a good son. She a good woman. You lucky. Maybe, bro. But can we focus on business right now? Yo, they just over here. Stay calm, and you won't get hurt. These guys are cleared out. Let's bounce. Luis, bro, you always pull us through this shit. Be easy. Degenerous. Be easy.
Oh, yeah, bro. I'm in a real rush, and I was thinking I could use a buffalo. You think you can get your hands on one? I'm coming right at you with that shit, L. Anything to help out a friend. You can never get tired of this next song. And once you do, you'll be too senile to remember any of the best times of your life. Let's think about that while we both listen to a song you've probably never even paid for. Yo, hey, you and H wanna do something? Okay, bro. H's are leaving busy, and I can postpone some shit. Come pick us up. Nice one, bro. Try not to get arrested before I get there.
Cash is in the house. That, homie. I might go back to the DR for a time. My Dia says she wants some company. You ain't going, man. I told you that. You're being weird, eh? Ricky can go wherever the fuck he likes. You might have forgotten, but I'm his boss, yo. We got a fucking business to run. It's just for a few months. You get someone to fill in. No fucking way. People go to the island, they don't come back. Like who? Like my dad for starters, and my mom for second. If the island left over by a third world cop, or you'll drown your dumb ass. You ain't fucking leaving me. Shit, eh? You can come too if you like. Oh, yeah, you got some real abandonment issues you gotta deal with, Armando. Damn. Get the real answer about her age with Radio Carbon Dating. For a small fee, we'll send you an RC. With a strand of her hair, saliva, or a frothy discharge, you can determine if you're going out with a granny or a girl that could get you jail time. Radio carbon dating and personal research. It's time to know the truth. Let's go listen to some news from Weasel. Weasel. Last week, Mr. Prince told reporters outside the court that the dorks and the LCPD are ruining the city and it's time we the people stood up to their bullying. Liberty City was founded on the principles of liberty, getting shit-faced and grinding on strangers. Please don't turn us into a suburb. In sweatshop news, sportswear megacorporation Eris has issued a statement defending its use of child labor in developing countries. In a statement on the Eris website, founder and CEO Eric Vassell defended child labor practices practices and pointed out the importance of montages and feel-good sports movies in the modern American psyche. This is Weasel News. This is Weasel News. Using your greed to advance. Let's just go get us a drink. That's freedom. Independence FM. Hey, boys up for a drink? For real, let's get pissed drunk. Shit, bro. I think I'm a little drunk. I'm fine. Always knew you was queer. I'm gone. You. Jesus. What 
is wrong with you? A little drink and you turn into morons. I'm totally fine. Really? For real. Then why you pissed yourself? <laughs> that ain't piss. Looks like piss. I spilled my drink. What, Max? Oh, fuck you two. Oh shit, sorry. <laughs> down at Mason at nine the other night with the other bricks and the DJ put this one on and the place went well really flat actually it's an awful record take a listen See you soon, El. Go hanging with you idiots.
couldn't. Oh, I don't believe this. Yeah, that's gotta hurt. No fucking way. Dímelo, fan. I don't want to trouble you, but I need a turismo. You think maybe you could bring one? I can't do that right now. Amanda got me looking after some stuff for him. I don't want him to get angry again. I'm afraid you're getting taxed, baby. He's gonna kill me! Hey. Uh, fuck off, Luis. Ay, Dios mío, have we been through this already? Been through the fact that you wanted to kill me? Been through the fact that you're far from alone that desire? This is over. It's over. I just want to go someplace far away from here and quietly wait to die. I lived it. I lived it hard, and now I'm ready to end it. Oh, shut up, you hysterical fucking queen. Get a grip, bro. Oh, yes. Silly me. <laughs> Silly fucking me. <laughs> the Russian mob want me dead. My best friend just contemplated murdering me. The mob are on my case. I'm massively in debt. And, and I just lost two million dollars worth of diamonds. Any other man would just dust himself off and carry on. Look, uh, okay, I'm sorry I thought about killing you. I really am. But if you keep up with the bullshit, I might have to kill you for real. Fuck off, Luis! No, you fuck off, Tony. I didn't kill you. I wanted to. Why? Because you've become a useless junkie fuck. That's why. But I didn't. And now, it's you and me against the world, okay? And if your brains ain't working right, then I'll make the decision for us, okay? It's Bulgarin or us. Or you can shoot us both and make his life easy for him. Well, you're kind of clever, aren't you? I only hired you because I thought you were dumb. Yeah, thank you very much. You're welcome very much. Are you coming now? Yes, I'm coming now. Well, let's go, come on. Salubri's associates told me that Bulgarin was in on the H deal at Funland on Firefly. Terror in the skies. A transatlantic flight from France's international. So, say we find them, what are we gonna do then? We're gonna take out their income stream, and then we're gonna take them out. End this bullshit. Okay, I'm armed, I'm dangerous, let's fucking do this! Monty, give me a break. What? We're in this together! Tony, bro, I love you. I should handle this alone. I don't want you getting yourself killed. Then you're gonna have to punch me out again, Lou. Don't make me, man. You know you're just gonna slow me down, bro. And kill us both. I want at least one of us to survive. Lou? Look, D, don't go home. Don't go to the clubs. 
Don't go nowhere anyone might conceivably think to look for you. There aren't many places like that left in the city, I'm afraid. Come on. Where do you think you can hide that no one would expect? I have no fucking clue. Uh, Dukes? I ran away from there when I was a kid, and I swore blind I'd never go back, apart from to catch a plane. Okay, cool. Hit up, like, uh, that monoglow monument thing in Meadows Park. Hang out for a few hours. If I survive this shit, I'll find you. If I don't show, then I'm gone. Move to Brazil. Move somewhere. You'll never look back, T. I thought I was the annoying drama queen in this pairing. I'm serious, T. This is my last testament. Yo, send some money to my mom sometimes. Tell her I love her. Okay, Lou, shit. You'll be fine. Shit. No one in this whole crazy town is crazy enough to take you down. Now we own junk trade in Liberty. Anyone need package, they must deal with us. Del Rey, there's an angry Dominican here. Come on, you- 
you, puto! If I kill, I get to... Talk, bro. It's just really coming apart. What do you need? Let me help you out. There ain't nothing you can do, Yusuf. If this crazy Russian fuck manages to leave the country, it's over for me and Tom. I gotta get down the Deuce Expressway without any number of Russian assassins taking me down. Or we're done. Why am I even saying this? Wish me luck, bro.
Blade! You kill me, we all die! I'll kill all of you! You can't shoot me, you'll blow whole plane up! I'll take my chances. Existence, Liberty City.
Oh. 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 Shit. Sorry, Pops. Oh. Come on, get up. Get up. Oh. You okay? Yeah, thanks. Take care of yourself, okay? Stay away from idiots like me. Fuck you. You always have to make a scene, don't you? Yeah, I know. It's a real problem with me, you know? I wish I was more like you. Subtle, shy, retiring. Yeah. <laughs> <sighs> oh, boy. I used to play around here when I was a kid. Dreaming of the world. Wondering what it was like at that place over there or that little island over there. You ever go that thing? Nah, I went to Algonquin instead. Waiting for the world to come to me. You did it, man. You did it. You, you saved my life. You, you saved the business. You, you fucking did it. Hey, man, I did what I could, bro. I'm proud of you, man. Thank you. But I don't want you to get a big head. I don't want you to go uh, change, become a megastar, go to Vinewood, write a blog. Oh. <laughs> You're a pill-popping old queen, man. I'm a murdering maniac. But we survived, bro. We survived. We did more than survive, amigo. We prospered. We took on this town and we won. We took on this place and we gave it the fucking finger. Fuck you all! I don't care what people say. Tony Prince and Luis Lopez could not be stopped. Huh? Oh, jeez, who's this? What's up, my niggas? Oh, did he just say that? Uh, yeah, hey, man. You fucking made it. Man, that was some serious gangster shit. Shoot, shoot, shoot him up. I said shoot, shoot, shoot him up. <laughs> Yo, T, T, give me a hug, give me a hug. Not too close, though. I don't want to give my father the wrong impression. Ah, Luis, I love you, man. I love you! I love you, too. I love everyone! Come on, let's get out of here. Oh, by the way, I think my father may be into franchising clubs. <laughs> I know. Franchise is not the way to go. The, the club is all about the people. Fuck the people! Fuck them all! Whip out your dick and piss all over them! <laughs> You're gonna go a long way in hospitality, my friend. Thank <laughs> you.
Hey, bro, I don't want you taking unnecessary risks, but I could really use a new stank. There's somewhere you could find one? No problem, homie. Anything to get off this corner.
strand of her hair, saliva, or frothy discharge, you can determine if you're going out with a granny or a girl that could get you jail time. Radiocarbon dating and personal research. It's time to know the truth. to be worth about two million dollars. Mr. Capel.
You're having the time of your life now, running around Liberty City, listening to music. Someday you'll look back on these days as the best days of your life. Then you'll snap out of that daydream and realise that you never were a real success, and all your friends hate it when they get a text message from you. Trust me, I know how that feels. Only until you stood in front of massive speaker stacks hearing this song at high decibels do you realise it is complete and utter shit. Taking it in the can from a stranger. Trackify's innovative GPS locator chip is implanted at the base of their head, so there's nothing to lose. Get the trust and peace of mind you deserve. You're listening to Independence, where you're the DJ and I'm just the paid mouthpiece without any soul. My name's Gary. I used to be pretty famous in the ex-girlfriend put a video of me naked online kind of way. Here's another tune.